What's up YouTube? This is Rear Station here and on this edition of Animal Reactions we're going to go ahead and react to episode 13 of Vintland Saga. So, kind of a setup here. Um, looks like uh, Kanute is like not a really, like let's just say he's not like, Dorfin and Kanute are totally different meetings here. And I, I kind of like how it was handled with the whole, you know, expression with, um, but with uh, with Thorfinn, he's just like I really, just like so mean. He's just like so mean and all. And then like uh, Kenny was just like all unsure and shit. I thought it was I thought that part was really funny. I I genuinely thought it was funny. But let's get to let's get to the point at hand. Um, now I don't think uh it was it was I don't think it was a. Uh, like I think, well, Thorkell's troop, Thorkell's troops are obviously gonna come. Like that's a given. Um, the whole the thing is, is just like, um, how is this the how is um, how, like what's gonna come out of here? Like, well, are we just gonna are we actually gonna see Askland die here? No, 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 no. It, like, no, I don't, I don't think so. Actually, what am I saying? Well, I saw I like us when it sucks, but. Because I know I've read, I have read up to, cha I think I'm on chapter 50, and I think I, there's some ways before it reaches where I ha where I left off. Um, all I can just say is, like, the whole, and the whole thing with the with them being attacked kind of speaks to how Wales is kind of disjointed as a, in a region, because, you know, the land's not exactly fertile, so you can't really set up civilizations, so it's kind of king... There's kind of just kingdoms just sticking their claims here and there. Um, I liked also the fact just like that one guy was like, he, he looks at Thorfinn and just like, oh, so yeah, I like your looks. So he's thinking that's the prince. And then he takes a look at and he's just like, no, 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 no. That's, con that's the prince right there. And he sees this canoe, this shy looking girlish, well, like looking feminine and all just like, uh, uh, I don't like this guy. <laughs> that was good. That was a good touch on there. I got a kick out of that. But uh, yeah, uh, without further ado, uh, let's just go ahead and jump into this. I mean, uh, this is this is why, uh, with Sundays, uh, I don't think Sundays are going to be particularly eventful besides Vinland Saga. Vinland Saga is going to be the same race because I have my qualms about how my, the previous show, the previous show that I did the first episode reaction to, I don't know how to feel about that yet. But uh, let's go ahead and get to this. So um, yeah. uh, I gotta check see if everything is all right. Okay. All right. Okay, U.S. Whatever. I mean, all the subs are supposedly shit anyway, from what I was told. But I don't have a bed. Uh, it's not like I have the luxury to wait for it. Like, so guys, calm your fucking tits about the subs. I can only I can only be here and there to get sub like come on man give me a break we we don't we can't ha all have nice things in this world right actually we don't we can never have nice things all right enough of my rambling starting in uh, episode 13 starting in three two one go You opening yet? Nope. Flashback, it seems. Wait, is that? Why does it look like Asklan? Why does it look like young Asklan? You opening? Wait, why is this a, is this the band that did Long Horizons opening? 
I don't, I don't, well, it sounds like, I, I, I guess it just sounds like them, so I don't know, I don't know yet. So that's Finland. Oh, the snake, that, that makes, that makes sense. Oh, it looks like Canoe's gonna get some development soon. Spoilers, spoilers in this opening. Actually, it doesn't matter to me anymore. Ooh. Ooh. I didn't reach I didn't go that far, but is that a sign? So you don't have to assume that Canute was captured and now he's somewhere else. <laughs> Dear son, really? Yeah, just dump a just dump a few uh, a few shards of your army with him and just let him get get ransacked by Dorkel. Yeah, yeah. Because they still call him your son. <laughs> Wow. <clears throat> Sorry. Yeah, this is bad right here. Also, why the horse had to get killed, man? What the horse do to you, man? Again, with a language barrier here. Mm, this is poor horse man. Just this just it just takes them whole meaning beat this dead horse and this Oh great. Everyone wants to fuck a piece of the prince. Hmm. A sheep with a wolf. A sheep with a wolf skin. That's something. That you that you usually hear the other way around. <laughs> Look on his face, though. Uh. 
Hey, no, hey, no pressure, no pressure, no pressure. <laughs> say, I, it won't work if you don't say it convincingly. It's not gonna. Ah, oh, so it's just messing with him now. Oh, his <laughs> fucking face, man. It's like, really, dude. <laughs> More like all the burns just been thrown onto him. Ooh. Yep, uh, yeah, the prince has, yeah, the prince has a many messed up sort of expert childhood experience. Childhood experience, my bad. Mm -hmm. Well, it looks like we can't rely on the prince right now. <laughs> Damn. Well, both it both both have some really bad childhood experience, but in a dip, they both they. Because the way they were they were brought up and all, and the what and how they were individually, you know, addressed it, like Dorfin wants revenge, and but Kanu just. Lip sealed his lips. Totally different. Pe to to similar. Not so different child experience. Totally different reactions to reactions to it. So you're gonna have to just do it the hard way. Okay, no, not really the hard way, but
He's an interesting character, of course he is. Well, it kind of goes back to Asklands, you know. So he was, so he's like one of those referred to him as War Goddess Britannia, huh? Uh I'm a, I'll like I was a legit about to make a really bad joke, but I'm gonna hold back. So some history. I mean, he does act like a, he, that is something that King Arthur would do. Ah, uh, yep, yep, it's, it's as yeah, it's Asuka. No, no, it kind of makes sense. I, it's been a while since I read that part of the chat in the manga, so I wasn't sure. I wasn't 100% sure, but I was just like, I'm pretty sure that's Asuka, and like... Hmm. Huh. <laughs> you sold now, man? The fact that Asgard has mixed blood, I mean, adds more to how interesting of uh, character he is.
And that he was basically like the scum child. Well, like, kind of like via the son of a concubine, you know. Which blood is more dominant, basically? Who are you more of? Uh. Yeah, a little bit of a foreshadowing for later. He says he hates the Danes. I mean, exactly, man. Right? <laughs> well, I wouldn't say that when you're basically, he's basically got, he's basically got in the palm of his hands. Of course, Dorfin's not going to admit that. He is, he is a slave to his own revenge. Let's be real here. He's too much of a he's too much of that to be really be to really get look at the bigger picture more properly. But it'll come to him one day. It'll it'll come to him slowly or slowly steadily, however long it takes. Before I, hopefully before some another thing particularly bad happens to him. Uh, yeah, not a really warm welcome, let's just say that. <laughs> oh, he missed. Yep, this... Wait, you didn't re Why are you actually so surprised, my dude? <laughs> Oh shit, you can talk! <laughs> and this is the... This is like by one of my favorite voice actors too. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> uh, pause it. <laughs> oh god! Like, like, shut this whole thing off. If you turn, if you if you close your eyes and just had something, or had this thing all black, the out of context shit. <laughs> well, when you got a asshole like. Well, Dorfin is kind of a, a an asshole. Like like him to just kind of the way he just kind of jabs at jabs at Canute directly. You're just like, really? You're my age, and you act like a you act like a little bitch. <laughs> he finally got to Canute, man. Like, I like that. I like that though. I honestly do. I will say qualms, but 
I I already knew that part though. Okay. Whoever is doing these, you really need to clean up your, these guys, the sub teams really gotta clean up some stuff. No matter how long it takes, I don't care. No, uh, this is when the bike, his, his men might start to get really discouraged and do some stupid shit. <laughs> So it seems like these visuals are just basically, these are the same visuals, but they're kind of just, they're, it's kind of like drawn in like a sort of, you know, more painted mode, more like a hand-drawn mode, or you know, not hand-drawn, uh, just kind of more like on some, I don't know how to describe it, but just kind of like more watercolor stuff and not much, so much more of animation, just kind of. And then it just goes back to the, that. Okay, yeah. Um, <clears throat> this is a it's really good. It's a really good episode. I, I, I have no problems about that. I will say that I feel sorry for those who thought uh, this was going to be a particularly. Um, uh, okay, I'll, I'll answer your mouse uh, later but during, <laughs> during the fucking recording, but. It go um so we get a little bit of a look in into Asklan and uh, I honestly forgot about that particular part. I mean it kind of I mean as for me at least at least when uh, for this show I think it has that sort of feel for me like it sort of it has a sort of feel. Well, let's be fair. I don't when I read the when I do read source material when I do and it's rare. I don't, I don't really remember specific little parts, uh, so, um, well, well, in detail. But I do kind of remember that there was a little bit of a touchback on Asklam. I didn't remember at the time, but I did, but I did remember that uh, Ask that uh, that Asklam did had some history as to why he makes himself so interesting, and the fact that he's not purely Dane, he's not purely Dane at all. Well, he is more of a mi he is mixed blood, and he's said, and he was able to negotiate with that guy. Like, oh, like if I like we can ha we can help you with this because if I get because if I'm able to get the prince back, I'll be able to assume his position and I'll be able to get the treaty with you guys, and you can really benefit off of that. It really worked. Now, of course, the qualms here is the whole language barrier thing. I mean, that's already a given. I mean, it's already a recurring thing within this series, and it's not even, and I don't think, and I think it's just not much of a choice. I mean, I, I will say that they could have hired, you know, 
uh, European voice actors at least. I mean that, or at least have the some of the VAs try to at least in, emulate some sort of uh, European language. I mean, try maybe go to a quick score, school course or European language course or something just before they start do the whole thing. But I mean, having watched Shirobako, I have not. I can only imagine how much I like the sort of decisions that had to be made and all. I mean, Shirobako was one of those shows, even though it's not a particular favorite. At least it has an insight to what anime production is. But not enough about that. But this is one of those shows, man. It, it is. It this is this is one of those shows that it's great, but it could be so much better. It it could be so much better. I would. I actually like it more than Berserk, uh, honestly, so far. But I think it could be objectively better than Berserk if it had a even better production, but production value added to it, like a project or so. But I'm I'm glad with what we got though. I I don't have I don't have uh any big any bigger uh issues with it. I mean I like it. It's kind of there's a there's a time like. This is not one of those where it's high action, which is all right, and so that's hence why it's not a shonen, and uh, it kind of just, you know, pulls you in, just trying to get you into that mood, and just kind of makes you f sort of feel like you're there. The entertaining part of this is the inter whole interaction between uh, Dorfin and Canoe, to, to the point where Dorfin finally gets to him breaks his silence and everyone was just like holy shit the princess can talk <laughs> i like how well the well the dorfin calls him the print the the prince uh, the princess and it, i like how it got to it and kensho ono's voice actor really sold it because i the, the kind of voice he has he has that how's how do i describe ono so like he has that sort of you know that chop that it can he can sound boy like a, like a young boy like a young naive boy all the time which kind of really sells the sort of character that it depends on like a character that doesn't feel manly but at the same time he can he can also be emulated as a as someone who has who could just sound really a pretty darn badass and cool and he can be really man like Jojo Giovanna Jono Giovanna for example um uh who else uh um there there's 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 one others um there's there's a there's a i i actually that's the 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 only one i can come up with i i i know there's some i mean i can't believe i forgot at this time but he he can also play like the the one that is just like really cheerful and all or has some sweat savviness to him like it it I like I, I like him. But I mean he doesn't have the sort of talent that I Kanayo has or maybe even like uh uh, uh some some others like some others have but he 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 he's his like the way he does the character like he ha he can bring the emotion into it and that's what I really like out of out of him. Um so yeah. Uh I is there anything else we really need to say? Um, I don't think there really is. If there is one other thing I do want to say, I mean that the fact that there will it it does seem like there will be a time like he says like Asuka says he hates the things, so it comes down to like is he going like the the and the men and the men you can see at at the end are clearly disgruntled that he wants to suddenly change routes, which kind of you know sets up something sets up some point for disaster. Uh, to come like where Askan could just go where the men, his men would more likely just turn on him at some point um i'm not gonna spoil about that but i can i honestly feel like this is just an underlying thing waiting to explode at some point in time um so yeah uh i don't really have much else to say if you want to go ahead and share your thoughts just go ahead and comment as always but that will do it for this reaction so if you like this video, hit that like, smash that like button. If you want to subscribe and support support my channel, because I really do need to get those subs back, just hit the sub, just hit, just hit sub, and you know, hit the bell icon if you want to get notification for new up, new upload content and updates. Uh, you can also check out you can also check out the other social media platforms that I, that, that I use as well, which will be Twitter, my Discord server, my Patreon page. You can also find me on Analyst and Miami List. 
as well. But uh, you can also check out the other the other YouTube channels that I support. But that'll do it for this edition of M Reactions. So until then, guys, we'll see you next time.